Welcome to the Rochester, New Hampshire History Podcast, a monthly show that will shine a light on a piece of history that has been all but forgotten. The headline for the October 21st, 1974 Rochester Courier was Frisbee Follies Weekend Planned. Homegrown talent will have its day when amateur and semi-professional performers from the greater Rochester area show their stuff during the third Frisbee Follies this weekend. The newspaper also reported that proceeds from the show would be used to defray the expense of an emergency generator for Frisbee Hospital. The Frisbee Follies Variety Show raised thousands of dollars for the hospital in the early 1970s. The show always played to sold-out audiences at the Rochester Opera House. Sadly, after the October 1974 performance of the Follies, the Opera House closed due to financial debt. It would be two decades before the Opera House reopened its doors again. Enjoy this episode as we revisit the homegrown talent that stepped onto the Opera House stage many years ago. Hopefully you will recognize a family member or a friend that performed in Rochester's biggest talent show, the Frisbee Follies.
This ends the podcast. If you have any questions or comments, please email bobgriffinpodcast at gmail.com. And come back next month for another episode of Rochester, New Hampshire History.